different different types of bees yes there are different types of bees today we're going to talk about it this is tikida from guide to beekeeping that info so let's go so there are different types of bees but today i'm going to talk about four types of bees in particular the apis florae the apis dorsata the apis sirena serana and the apis mellifera i'm sorry if my pronunciation is not very good um i'm not the native english speaker yeah but let's go the apis florae Bees from the Apis florae types are characterized by a smaller size when compared to the others. And um, what can be said also of the Apis florae bees are the fact that they don't tolerate a lot of disturbances. So if there is a lot of disturbances, this type of bees might complete my abandon their hives. Next, we talk about the Apis dorsata. The Apis dorsata are also bees that can abandon their hives when they are disturbed. However, they seem to bear, to bear more disturbances than the Apis florae. But similarly to the Apis florae, the Apis dorsata bees also construct single comb hives that can be found suspended from trees. Next we have the Apis serana. This third species of bees is also called the oriental honeybee. The oriental honeybee is an active pollinator and covers a wider area than the previous two species of bees that we've talked about. Concerning the size of the Apis serana, it is not possible to define a single size because these type of bees are found in different places that have different climates of climates and bees of um, this type are consequently of different sizes. So in contrast with the previous species, the Apis serana can be domesticated. Finally, the Apis mellifera. The Apis mellifera, uh, our last category today, are bees that uh, build parallel combs in cavities like tree trunks. So the Apis mellifera colonies are characterized by a consistent division of labor within the members. Moreover, these bees have a social hierarchy that is well maintained. So this is about it today for the four common four common honeybees types. However, if you want to learn more, you can go to guide to be keeping that info and uh, get a free mail course about beekeeping. The free mail course doesn't really, doesn't talk about the, the only bees in particular, but to get the email course, you enter your first name and your email address and then click on the button and then go to your email address and confirm this subscription. But if you want to do something more than that, you can go to guide to beekeeping that info slash ebook and there you'll learn about an ebook about beekeeping. If you want to get the beekeeping book, that's good. If you, you can get the free ML course at guide to beekeeping info. And this is about it. I wish you a very good day. Bye.